Two new educators in Brainerd are starting to get their feet planted in their new community. Today, both Harris Charlier, president of Central Lakes College, and Lane Larson, the superintendent of the Brainerd School District, attended a business meet and greet to discuss some of their early priorities moving into their new positions. Our Chelsea Brown tells us they plan on making it a collaborative effort. The idea of connecting business with K-12 schooling and higher education in the Brainerd Lakes area has many excited to work with the two new education leaders. Three words that I would use to describe both Lane and Hera would be passionate, uh, positive and down to earth. I, I think we couldn't have asked for uh, two better women to come in and be good leaders and partners of our education institutions and we really think there's going to be a stronger business connection with them at the helm. Both Hera Charlier and Lane Larson are in their first month of their new jobs and today they shared some of their early priorities within the education system. How are we going to best educate our students and give them the tools that they need and the skills that they need for the future with online learning opportunities, post-secondary enrollment opportunities, college in the high school, whatever it is that we need to do that we can partner to work together to help the students that we have in our school that become part of yours which become great productive citizens in our community. And after learning more about the community of Brainerd, the two new educators have some of the same ideas in regards to education and how to unite their efforts for the kids in the community. Together, we are committed to that. We know we have opportunities for students as we look at how they navigate their way through the, our, our school systems. We know those rides can be bumpy. We have an opportunity to strengthen those pathways. That work has already begun and make sure that students are spending their time learning not figuring things out. Knowing the potential opportunities in the community, they also realize the need for workers. And as education leaders, they want to change the narrative for college, meaning any path with a post-secondary credential. As uh, businesses continue to look to find workers, and we have a critical shortage right now, we need to strengthen those relationships, and I feel they're going to take us to the next level. With those main priorities, they hope to train the workforce for tomorrow to benefit the community. In Brainerd, Chelsea Brown, Lakeland News. Both education leaders plan to work closely with the Bridges Workplace Connection to link students to career exploration and experience. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.